Okay, then let's get going to the Seronia place. Just hop on the train and take that choo-choo the north. Right, tickets please. Go on then, all aboard. There's surprisingly little overworld travel in this game. I'm actually kind of okay with that. Pretty. Somebody in chat says they really Holy want to watch. Maze. Oh. I could stare for days at this place. Looks like we're gonna have to find a way through. Okay, support abilities. Sizzle. Mirage's sizzle ability can be used to burn away vegetation or melt ice that's blocking your path. Oh, it might also might also be able to lit fuse light fuses. You can use sizzle whenever you see a flame. Just bring a barrage that no sizzle to that spot. Examine it to get burning. If things get the dangerous or you need a break, don't forget that you can use the gates to return to Ninewood Hills and take a time out. Ifrit, you are goofy looking. Okay. Somebody in chat is saying they need to watch Kingslave. Yeah, you do. It's... There's not a whole lot of plot. I mean, there's plot. Mostly, it's just really cool looking. Like all Final Fantasy movies ever are. Like, if you like Advent Children, you're probably really gonna like, uh, Kingsclave. What? You kidding me? <laughs> okay, so, first and foremost... Swamp the Moose. Luckily, they shouldn't be protecting each other. Oh. That one's not dead yet. Surprise. Okay, so we want to do t -t 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 abilities, Libra. Yeah, yeah. Okay, use fire attacks to create a prism tunity. Uh, it's a reaver move. Unfortunately, I think I'm fresh out of fire. Yeah, I got wind. All right, I guess we'll just beat the crap out of it and throw in a fire. Ah, balls. All right, looks like we're gonna have to throw Ifrit on the top. That'll be fine. Uh, let's see, ooh, Copper Gnome's up to level 10. Is that one of the ones I needed or did we need to keep going at? I think we need to keep going past. Plus we don't have any transformations. Okay, stacks it up. Actually, honestly, let's switch out the Black Choker Chick for Ifrit, if anything. I do it, I do it, uh, otherwise, but the Black Choco Chick doesn't even know anything yet. So it's kind of meaningless in combat. I'm actually really curious how all of them work. Okay, let's take a look at that. Yep, we got a little side area and other things. And looks like we got him again. Okay. Let's just take out the... Those okay. We want to unstack. We want to unstack. Let's see. So this is lawn. Nothing. Ow. Defend. Defend. Abilities. Fire. Okay. Weak to it. Not dead yet. Perfect. And then good. He's he can still cure. So we do, we do have a, uh, we do have a healer, if we need one. And balls. Okay, let's stack back up. Uh... Imprism. I'm glad that all the constituents can, uh, can stack. Okay, so we're just gonna defend. Defend. Okay. Stack. Oh, wait, no. She doesn't need to defend. What am I talking about? 
Come on, catch it. Catch that dumb looking squirrel. Got it. All right. I don't know if this is actually particularly useful, but still. Victory! Like, I'm probably just gonna keep my regular Moo around. Could also stack him on top, but still. Okay, never mind, it's separate. A Moo originally found in a place called River Bell. Why is it called a Reaver Moo? Well, kids, well kids, it's because it was mistranslated in that other game. However, the idea of a cute, fluffy river mirage plundering grimoire was so charming that we decided, what the hey? And that's how mistakes live forever. <laughs> it's cute. We're gonna leave it with Seraphie for the time being though. I wanna get the other one later. Gotta imprison them all, absolutely. Okay, speaking of, what can we get in the area? So we are in Pyroglow Forest, so we can get a baby behemoth, not so useful. Cactrot, Cockatrice, Death Skull, Dual Lizard, Moogle, Moo, Right Claw, Reaver Moo. All right, so I've got like three or four of those. This is gonna take some work. It'll be fun though. Hopefully there's like a save crystal towards the end or something, I don't know. We might actually have to come back for some of them too. Uh, that'll be work. I hope not. I hate backtracking. Like, I don't mind it too much. Oh, how are we supposed to get past these vines? What's the symbol? That's one of Inna Crow's the patented sizzle symbols. She got it patented? That's your cue to the brain along the mirage that's learned the sizzle ability. And if you don't have a mirage with the sizzle ability just yet, you're sure to find one close to by, so keep looking. Oh, I don't even have to do anything. Thank you, Ifrit. And we got a Thunder Seed. Oh, which teaches one of the guys Thunder, if I want to do it. Okay, what was I going to mess with? I don't know. Let's see, does anybody have a ton of SP? I guess the Black Choker Chick does. Let's take a look at what we can do with the Black Choker Chick. So, unfortunately, we're going to have to actually obtain something before we can keep going. Yeah, it kind of makes the obtain obtaining Choker Chicks... Uh, the black choker chick a little bit less nice. I guess I'll work for haste. That'd be nice. But yeah, it probably means I'm not going to be using the black choker chick that much. Wait, no. I didn't want the mini golem. Okay, I wanted to take a look at the copper gnome. What level do you get up? Oh. We've got the... Uh, I'm... Sorry? He's huge. Alright, running back to the beginning of the area. We just got our first large. Uh, we just got our first large. I want to go mess with that. And this will let me have a different, uh, completely different team comp. Which is nice, yeah, I was starting to feel bad, because I wasn't going to be using the copper, even though he was super close to actually being Dude, something. Let's make this good. That's a thing. That's a weird... Oh, that's probably like the cockatrice or whatever. I'm not entirely sure. Well, let's see, whose turn is it? Abilities. We don't have much... Topple, topple strength low. Topple strength low. We'll try it anyway. Yeah, it didn't... Didn't really figure. Oh, horn. Nope. All right. So they're just almost dead, which means let's just kick their asses. I toppled them in death. Well, that ought Good to do job. It. All right. So looks like we're pretty good. I love the uh, sort of evolution version. I just saw an Emvert next to his form, or am I blind? Don't know. Even if it is, I'm going to totally switch the uh, Copper Golem. Okay, so we want to transfig you. Oops. Into a Mithril Giant. Yep, it's it's big. What can I switch you out for? Yeah, so there's the Reaver move, but I don't think I'm going to mess with that. Okay. 
So while we're here... Oops. I'm forgetting which menu buttons I have. Okay, stacks it up. So she's got Sylph and Baby Emeth. I'm gonna give her the golem. Or the giant. And... Could do Tama. Actually, let's go with that. Okay, there we go. Let's see this in action. I'm legitimately curious. Got here, ready for Final Fantasy 15. Been 10 years. Oh, really, has it been 10 years? I don't know. Anyway, uh, what moves do, do they have? So we've got Shake. Ooh! Ooh, Tremor. Yes. Okay. So, oh! Tremor hits everybody. Yes! Okay, they resisted it, but still re freaking cool. I love it. Okay, let's heal up a bit. Okay. Let's do... Let's keep curing for the time being. Might as well be full health. And let's keep doing... Oh, we can't do that again. Alright, fine. How much damage do they do? Eh. Not that much. That's okay. Yeah. He looks awesome. Freaking... I don't know. The, the, the monster design in this game is great. I love it. I love it for them to just like totally remix like this several different times. I uh, into like different games. Like, God, I miss the Dragon Warrior Monster series so much. And this would be ah, uh, that would that would be good. Oh, I guess I really did cut myself earlier. Owie, there's nothing up there. A lot of treasure chests though. That you really don't have to go out of your way for. Oh, that's fine. Alright. Uh, let's see, what are we up against? Uh, Here we go! Oh. Okay, this is going to take some doing. So we want a Libra... The Dual Lizard. What do you need? Reduce the Mirage's... Well, that's... Really easy. I wonder if I can... Leaper the Moogles, too. Okay. Restore their HP. Prism Tunity. Okay! Well, this makes it really easy. So, we're kind of overleveled. Makes these guys kind of easy to fight. So, for starters, uh, let's kick their ass. Then we want to unstack. Is that it? Nope. So, didn't get him. Who is this? It's the whole stack. Okay. Wonder if reduce their HP is something different. Okay, how much damage does he do? Not enough. But that's okay. Let's see if I can just straight up heal the Moogle from here. Maybe the Moogle doesn't actually need to be... Yeah! Okay. So I don't actually even need to do anything to him. Okay. Perfect. Input. Come on, catch him! Nope. Okay, we want to stack back up. Catch everybody! Catch, catch! Yes! Okay, there's a duo lizard. And the last one's a Moogle, which makes this really easy. And perfect. Okay! wasn't so bad. Two new, uh, two new monsters. Straight for me. Okay. So I don't want to, I probably don't want to mess with this too much. Eh, I might actually keep the dual lizard. I don't know. Okay, one body, twice the lizard. Rap battles itself regularly, but always loses. That's because it spits so much poison in the mic, it melts. So it's a poison type. View abilities. So, water, double attack, poison bite, bunch of things, and then it keeps going. Oh, turns into kind of a 
weird poison lightning dragon thing. Neat. But yes, it's a two-headed chibi dragon. Which we are going to keep with the name. Looks good. Do we take it with us, though? Yes, because I got a goblin. Get out of here. You're useless and I don't like you. And the Moogle. Everybody's favorite fuzzball with a funny way of talking, Koopo. Attacks and heals using equally funny dances. Apparently, they're willing to take just about any job if it means they get a role in the story. <laughs> All right, uh, let's see. I probably should have renamed it to Mog. Let's see if I can rename it later. Uh, let's see if I can take it with me in trade for nobody. I actually really like all of these. Except for Black Choco Chick. You know what? Let's put away Black Choco Chick. I keep the Black Choco Chick, but if my ch my current Chocobo is interchangeable... I know. How high up are we? I wonder what would happen if we jumped. Hey, why don't you find out? Go on. We go waiting. Uh, I'll pass. Oh, hello. Oh, it's only level 13? I might actually be able to do that. It'll be a rough customer. Here, let's come back and get this at the end of the area. We've still got some more guys to fight and catch and whatever. Okay, so for starters, we got some hurt. Okay, meaning we should probably heal this stack back up. Honestly, let's just leave it on auto. We're going to need to do that a couple of times. Oh, what? Oh, they couldn't do it twice. Oh, maybe it's a lot more AP than I thought it was going to be. Okay, let's take off auto battle. Right, that's what I was... That's what I forgot to do. There we go. Yeah, Yeah. so we already have the baby e -myth. I think, really, all we need at this point is the... Cock, uh, Cactrot and Cockatrice and Death Skull. And Right Clock. God damn, there's a ton. Alright, well, this is gonna take forever. <laughs> my Golem is swole. I love my Golem. He's cool looking. And I can always... I can always, uh, switch her back and forth huh? between. What's that light? Oh, I wonder if we run into, like, Yuna and company. I will admit, I don't like actually adventuring in Shibi form. It looks weird. It looks really weird. Music's really nice, too. God damn. I'm really excited for Final Fantasy XV. If this looks the way it currently does, mmm. Okay, and it is nothing but fodder for me. I don't know. I don't remember what these guys were weak to. Oh, I can tell. The answer is they suck against Earth. What about regular Moogles? This is going to take a while. Okay, Moogles have no such uh, resistances. That's fine. Eh, cross slash. Probably should heal. Whatever. Oh, Tremor's only six. Weird. Yeah, it turns out those dragons are actually kind of... kind of weak to stuff. Alright, let's just... let's heal this stack back up. Yep. Oh, oh, they're poisoned. I got it. Oh, can we... can we do Tremor again? Yep, of course we can. Uh, I love the I love the golem. He's super cool looking. I, I love all of the critter oh, designs. They look Good awesome. Job. I will admit, the chocobo. I I was really hoping I'd just get a straight up chocobo, and then there'd be like a crazy robo chocobo or something like that. I don't know. Whatever. Uh, let's see. Anything else? The answer is no. We got past this point. Yeah, I always take the less beaten path. Just because you, there's usually a treasure chest or something else. Not a huge fan of this game. I mean, it's not. It's because it's kind of more of like a fan service game, 
and uh, Square Enix's like first direct uh, entry into hi. This is a lot. Uh, first direct entry into Monster Collection, at least within a Final Fantasy game, from what I remember. There was, um, I mean, there's like the Dragon Quest monsters, but that was Atlas, not Square Enix, wasn't it? I don't entirely know. I don't know. I'm actually pretty down for it. The the plot and the writing is like, eh. but the um, but the actual like mechanics for the game are absolutely wonderful, and what it exactly what I was looking for. Like um, God, what was it? Well, I mean, I I played Digimon Cyber Sleuth, Digimon Story Cyber Sleuth earlier this year, and that was actually one of my more popular series. But I think this one's actually rivaling it. Which is kind of nice. Um. Oh. Balls. Okay, this. This is going to take some doing. Alright. So let's cure this group. So here's what we're going to have to do. We need to stack, unstack them. I missed. Balls. Okay. Shake him again. Okay. Let's Libra them. Okay. So what do we got? So we got a Moo. Don't care. We've got a Cockatrice. Physical attacks. That's easy enough. And... This. I think we're just missing. I don't think it's immune to um this. Final Fantasy Explorers had a monster collection thing to it. Ah. Didn't know. Okay, I guess he's somehow immune to that move. I don't know why. Okay. I'll just body slam him or something. That works, right? Yes. Okay, and we can keep curing. I might have to cure them. This is the first time I've come across a triple stack enemy group. Okay. Abilities. Okay. Can I get him with the body slam again? Yes. Okay, it's kind of a pain in the butt. Luckily, you can defend. Uh, to get AP back pretty fast. And luckily, he's not going to be able to do much to me as I am. All right, body slam. There we go, got him. All right, this is exactly what I'm looking for. Alright, so whose team is this? This is Team Healy Squad. That's unstacked a lot of them. We got a healer. Alright, abilities, cure. Chocobo. Probably should have healed the other stack before we separated. Okay. So this is big stack. Take out that Moo. Okay, Moo is down. Alright. Got him. Alright, so whose turn is this? Is Chocobo's abilities can't cure. We'll defend then. Okay. We're gonna unstack. We wanna do attack. I can always heal them up if need be. Okay, it's Chocobo's turn again. Abilities, cure, Chocobo. Okay. Not yet. Uh, who is this? Imprison. There we go. Come on, take it. Nope. Whose turn is this? Golems. Okay, got them both. Come on, catch. 
Got him. All right, so we got a right hand, which is weird and creepy, and it's large, too. So I think I might actually keep that one in the party for the time being. All right, now we've got this. Stack back up. Got him, too. Yes. Okay, and this one's going to be medium type. Oh, yeah. I'm probably going to switch them around and stuff. Okay. Remember a game that if you were like four levels lower than an opponent, you couldn't hit them. That's actually really common. However, I will m make note that um, I think I'm over leveled. <laughs> so probably not that. I don't know. Okay, Mirage that loves slicing and dicing. Dangerous when paired with left claw. Insists that it's left handed, but it's right. Wait. Okay, so we got another large, so I'm probably going to keep him with me. Uh, let's see. People would like another... Uh, let's get rid of the Moogle. I'm not a big fan of Mooglers. <laughs> Honestly, I mean, they're cute, but still. Okay, and we've also got this one. Uh, this is a Cockatrice. A bird with a poisonous beak that sometimes insta-KOs its prey. It doesn't have a flutter ability, which may be attributed to the fact that its wings are eyebrows. The least it could do is keep those bad boys better trimmed. That was a noise. Anyway, let's leave that with Seraphie for the time being. Okay. The other thing people would like would... Uh, people would also like a Final Fantasy Tactics game. Oh, man. Can you imagine if there's a Final Fantasy Tactics game that used this kind of, like, either character or monster collection or both? You know, you could dabble in a little bit of, bit of both along the way. Oh, that'd be so nice. Okay. Uh, let's do stack setup for a second here. Seeing as we've got right claw, I'm not a, I'm not going to use it immediately because he's not the right level, but still. Okay. And I'll probably throw Tom on the top of his head. But yeah, I, I really enjoyed Final Fantasy Tactics. Uh, the only reason why I never, I've never played them is they're freaking long. And there's no way I could commit to that kind of thing easily. Without getting like kind of frustrated myself. And whatever. Okay, so let's take a look. Whoa, this guy's got a huge board. So what's this? 25. Looks like he's only got one transformation, but boy is his... His, uh... Board... Comically large. Oh, we might as well grab that for the time being. Uh, let's see. We've also got Duo Lizard, who has... Two large size versions. So we've got a poison bite. So you gotta be at level 24 for that one or 10. Okay. What's this ability? Double attack. It's damage hits twice. Yeah, what I'm probably gonna do is. Are we going to have enough AP for that? Or SP for this? Probably not if we want to get the transformation. So I might have to go down first. Yeah. Probably. That's expensive. Alright, that's fine. That's enough management. Okay, so we've only got one... Uh, one monster left that we haven't seen in this forest. Plus, uh, we can go back for that other... Mirage. I mean, I, honestly, maybe I should actually go back right now. Let's go back right now so I don't have to backtrack too much. Let's backtrack to have to backtrack less. Because, yeah, I'm level... I'm level, like, 10, 11, give or take. And my party's pretty damn strong. I'm not too worried about this. Let's go with... Let's take him out, then we'll heal. Yeah, sadly, I can't save. But, nice thing is, saving is actually really easy in this game. Um, like, what you do is, uh, well, not saving, but like, loot, like dying does not actually set you back unless it's in a right. specific uh, right. boss fight. But even then, like, whatever, it doesn't matter. I'm not even sure why it gives you the game over. It does, the, like, the exact same thing. But that's okay. All right. Yeah, I wonder if we get to run into like Yuna after this. Probably, considering we've got the the spirits or whatever they're called. 
I don't remember. It's been a long time. I don't know. I'm, I'm just excited that uh, Square Enix is, is uh, experimenting again. Yeah, let's just hit him. We've already got them all. Let's see. Thinking they're kind of doing time travel concepts, changing Final Fantasy history, and saving dead Final Fantasy. Which means this game could save Victory. Aerith. I... I could see Aerith living through this game. Yeah. Just because this is kind of aimed at kids and stuff. I don't know. I guess... I'm really excited. I'm really excited that they're experimenting in general. I mean, this is a very experimental game. I Am Setsuna was interesting. Kind of a nice throwback. Alright, so what are we up against? Shark things. Alright. For better or worse, let's Libra. Alright, so what do these suckers need? Fire attacks. I think we're good. Yes! Okay, we are, we are good. Alright, so let's... These guys are gonna hurt, but I don't think we're in that big of danger yet. We're gonna have to keep him on pure healing up until we get to, get to the last man. Okay. We might be in trouble here. Okay, well, it's okay, I got Phoenix down. Are you kidding me? Still not dead yet. Alright, so we want to do abilities. Can't cure. Guess we'll stack back up. Try and live through it. Unfortunately, it looks like they're hammering him entirely. Well, this is going to go poorly for me. I wonder how many Phoenix Downs I have to use here. Alright, items. I got a ton of these. Sort of. Oh! Heals everybody! Barely. Ah, oh, fuck. Well, that sucks. Items. Mega Phoenix. Ah! Could have done that. Would have helped. We're just gonna restore Chocobo. And Chocobo is going to restore Lamp. Split up the targets a little bit. Okay. Fuck. Okay. I gotta have abilities that do damage here. Oh yeah, let's check something. What are these guys weak to? Lightning. That sucks. <sighs> Okay, that's some bonus damage. He's looking kind of worse for the wear. Abilities can't cure either, really. Why not? I don't know. Whatever. Alright. Well, I'll buy more of these when we're done. Extra targets! Not great, but it'll do. As long as I can slowly wallop these guys down. As long as there's only two left. Items, potion... Chocobo. Chocobo is going to tank its way through this fight. Whether it wants to or not. Shark will... Come on. It's a bad miss. Alright. Let's cure the little stack. Body slam. Alright, there they go. But that's fine. Yeah, we got this. This is an expensive fight. But considering I'm not using my money for anything else in this game. As long as it doesn't take out... As long as it doesn't take out Chocobo, we're okay. Alright. Chocobo can potion itself. Oh, wow. Potions heal for a lot. Okay. Let's see. It's gonna cost me an arm and a leg in potions, but that's fine. Use Mega Down. Nope. I'm saving Mega Down for for a specific moment in this fight. Ooh, 
which would be right now. There we go. Alright, so we want to do abilities, fire. Got him. How injured is he? Not very. Let's see if I can make it more. Yep, figured he'd resist it. I'm going to keep using fire on him. Okay, it's more swooshy. Come on, get him. No. Balls. All right. Probably can't do this more than once more. But that's okay. Because he's on his lo lonesome. Got him. All right, so we got a shark thing. Yeah. Whatever. All right. Yeah, that was an expensive fight. Hopefully I can buy more Mega Phoenixes. Okay, an aquatic mirage with a short temper that regularly attacks swimmers. Plans to one day star in some movie. Chomper 2, The Shark Wolf. There is no part one. <laughs> uh, I like that. We're keeping this guy. Goodbye, Duel Lizard. You were neat, probably. But I just, I'm having a hard time caring about you. Don't potions usually heal for, heal for ridiculous amounts in Final Fantasy games? I don't know. That's an interesting question. Alright, so where's where's the shark wolf? There we go. So he's medium. So yeah, he goes up to large and huge. And we've got water joyride. And then level 20 and 30. Okay, so this guy's gonna last for a while. I'm okay with that. I'm definitely okay with that. 